Septic tanks are specialized underground chambers made of materials like concrete, fiberglass, or plastic. They're designed to treat and handle both toilet waste, black water, and other household wastewater, gray water. There are various types of septic tank systems and here we will be discussing the basic and conventional septic tank systems. How Septic Tanks Work In a typical septic tank system, two key stages of treating the wastewater are settling and anaerobic reactions. The process results in a harmless liquid effluent that can either soak into the ground or be further treated. In the given general layout of a septic tank system, you can see that the wastewater from the household enters through the inlet and comes out of the outlet pipe. Now the wastewater entering the tank separates into three parts, solids, effluents, and scum. Solids sink to the bottom and turn into sludge. The solids are decomposed by microorganisms in the absence of oxygen, thus forming the main anaerobic reaction in the system. At the same time, the scum, like oil and grease, floats on top. The remaining water forming the effluent exits through underground pipes through the outlet pipe. This effluent is taken either to a soak pit or drainage field for further treatment. This is where natural processes purify the wastewater as it seeps into the ground. Key Components of a Septic Tank System Let's discuss the main key components of a septic tank in detail. 1. Inlet Pipe and Inlet Baffle Wastewater enters the tank through the inlet. An inlet baffle prevents scum buildup and helps solid settle. 2. Sedimentation Tank Inside the tank, heavy particles sink, and microorganisms break down solids in an oxygen-free environment. 3. Baffle Walls These walls extend the time sewage spends in the tank, allowing for better solid settling and preventing scum blockage. 4. Outlet Pipe and Outlet Baffle Treated effluent passes through an outlet baffle to prevent scum and solids from entering the outlet pipe. 5. Soak Pit Slash Drainage Field The final treated effluent goes to a soak pit or drainage field, where additional purification occurs before it reaches the groundwater. A soak pit doesn't recycle water but ensures safe discharge into the underground soil, eventually reaching the groundwater. Proper design, construction, and maintenance are crucial for the septic tank system to work effectively. Remember, the outlet must be lower than the inlet to prevent overflow. How to maintain your septic tank? Regularly pump out solids to prevent buildup. Avoid flushing non biodegradable items. Use septic safe cleaning products. Monitor water usage to prevent overloading. Have a professional inspect and maintain as needed. Septic tanks may not be glamorous, but they play a vital role in environmental and public health. So, there you have it, the basics of a septic tank system. It's a hidden solution beneath our feet, quietly doing its job to keep our homes and the environment clean. For more informative videos on civil and environmental engineering, subscribe to Civil Engineering Fanatics.